This is Don. Hey, buddy, how you doing? Fine. Yeah, is this the uh, paranormal research hotline? Mm hmm. Okay, yes, it is. good, 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 good. I got major problems. What kind of problems do you have, sir? I think I have a ghost. Beg your pardon? I think I have a ghost in my house. You're, okay, you're cutting in and out. I'm sorry if I asked you to repeat things. Just mm. bear with me. Okay, I think I saw a ghost in my house. Okay. Uh, is this the first time you've seen it? Yeah. I damn near, I damn near soiled myself. Okay. Have you heard any noises or anything before this? Uh, I heard, I heard a few noises coming from my son's room, and it was pretty late, you know, and uh, he had his girlfriend spending the night, you know, they ain't married or anything, so I wasn't worried about that, but I heard a lot of strange noises. It was like, uh, it was like a moaning and a thudding sound. Almost like uh, there was watery sounds. All right. Yeah. Any movements or anything? Uh, it's a lot of groaning, not not necessarily movements. It did, however, sound like there was a lot of commotion. Uh, at one point, it really sounded like a rusty spring movement. You know, like springs. Okay. Uh, whereabouts are you located? <sighs> I'm in California, right about a town away from L.A. It's a little, little nook and cranny town. Okay. Yeah. So do you think it, this is a ghost? I mean, because it looked like, I mean, it looked horrible. It looked... Okay, picture Joan Rivers, but dead, and then uh, translucent. <laughs> well... There's many things it could be, as far as that goes. Uh, there's no way to read a judge or anything else over the phone. Or would it, but have to. sir, sir, are ghosts violent? I mean, are they prone to like outbursts of a uh, of a violent, maybe sexual nature? Are ghosts capable of it? Yeah, I, I've read uh, some things about sexual within the, the specter world, but. Uh, have I ever seen it? No. What have you heard, though? I mean, share with me, because I'm interested. This is what I'm worried about here. What have you heard? Well, there's uh, several different types of uh, uh, male violent uh, spirits uh, throughout the decades that have uh, sexual tendencies and stuff like that. But uh, at the present time, we can't pass a judgment that that's what you're actually dealing with. Like I said, the best thing to do is... Uh, sit down, we'll, we'll go over some things, I can tell you how to keep an eye on it and everything else to see what you discover. So you're telling me there's a chance that this ghost might commit a violent sexual crime on me? No, I'm not saying that in any way, shape, or fashion, sir. I'm saying that there are stuff in the past that uh, deal with uh, certain things, but at the present time, we don't even know it's a ghost. But I know I'm I'm, I have a feeling deep down in, in the pit of my stomach that this ghost is going to rape me. Well, let's, let's get somebody there to where they can actually help you and everything. Sir, is there, an is, there a hot, sir is there a hotline, or maybe a ghost rape hotline, anything like that? that um, I, no, there's not a ghost rape hotline. Your name? My name? Uh-huh. Robert, Robert Lane? I'm sorry? Robert Lane? Robert? Lane. Spell the last name. Lane uh, or yeah. Lane? Lane, like L-A-N-E, like I'm going to park my car in a lane. Okay. Yeah. Uh, an address, Robert? Whoa, 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 my address. It's the best way for me to get the information to the person that might be able to help you there your locally. Well, that all sounds a little bit creepy, just giving away my address to somebody I don't know. I mean, I don't even know what I'm dealing with here. No, I understand that. That's why we're trying to help you here. Well, okay. How about a phone number that they can contact you back at? Sir, I... Look, I didn't mean to get personal with you, but I'm just going to have to come out and tell you. You're not going to understand the problem that I'm having. 
I think my wife is cheating on me with the ghost. Okay. You think your wife is cheating on you with the ghost? Yes. Okay. That's embarrassing. It's... it's just, I don't know what to do. Okay, well, uh, as I said, there's very little I can actually do. The ghost, the ghost the transmit diseases to humans? Is that recorded? I mean, could he possibly no. transmit? No. Well, that's good. That's, I've not read anything like that. In but any that, but that, but that, but that means that he's not using a condom, which might result... It, can they get women pregnant? Has that ever been... No, no, nothing like that, sir. Huh. See, what? I'm just going to be honest with you. What happened was I was laying down in bed. I heard this noise, okay? I, 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 it awoke me. Like I said, I thought it was coming from my, my son Pork and his girlfriend in the other room. I, I get up. Uh, I don't see my wife in the bed. Uh, you know what I mean? And I hear commotion uh, in our spare bedroom, which is adjacent to the room that I'm sleeping in. So I get up to go look in there and... Uh, some some figure, you know, went right out the window. But it wasn't like he penetrated the walls. He opened the window and jumped out. He had no pants on, no nothing. And there in the bed was my wife. Now, this ghost was um, darker than you and me. You know what I mean? He was a uh, a black black ghost, from what I could uh, from what I can tell. And I just I think it was. It was trying to have a relationship, a sexual relationship, with my wife. Mm -hmm. Now, I, see. I don't know, I mean, what do you think? <laughs> Sir, uh, I've never heard of that before. Uh, a shadow, black figure, uh, a ghost, no. It wasn't. It wasn't a shadowy figure. It was almost humanoid. It it jumped out the window and then got into his Lincoln sixty five, and drove off. Mm -hmm. Now, does that sound like something ghosts do? Because that's what my wife said that it was a ghost, and then I and I'm trying to like you know in the heart of hearts believe her. But I'm having a hard time. That, I'm asking you as a professional, do you think what I have here is a ghost? As I said earlier, I, I don't uh, give judgment calls over the phone or anything else, but if you don't feel like it was a ghost, if you feel like your wife is cheating on you, you might call cheaters. They're real good at following these people around and finding out if they're real or not, or it's your imagination, or you like to call them and pranks over the phone at certain times of the night, whatever it might be. If you're serious about getting help for a ghost paranormal activity of any type, we'll be glad to help you. If you're calling to jerk or change and everything, you're not going to get any loud. You're sir, not going to get any agitated sir, or anything else. Sir, mm -hmm. nobody is trying to get you riled or agitated here. I was asking you about a problem that I'm having. My wife consulted Well, sir, you, there's, there's no way to judge what you saw. What you need to do... What I think I have here is a nigger ghost from the past trying to have sex with my white wife. Okay, I said it. What you need to do is, number one, get your camera. Set it up in your house. Okay. Record the times and stuff you hear. Okay. Put your a little voice recorder down. Okay. Get your evidence that way, one way or the other. All right. If you want local help, I'll be glad to turn you on to a chapter there in the California area or Oregon area and uh, get you some immediate help. Um, listen, do uh, do ghosts usually have gentles or is that unheard of? Uh, sir, I've never seen a ghost. Well, then what kind of expert are you? I've been doing it for 35 years. I've never seen a ghost. So why are you doing it? To find out what happens after we, our bodies are uh, gone. Sir. Where do our sir, energy sir, go sir, to? Sir, it's called the Bible, sir. Sir, religion has nothing to do with this. Hey, you read hey, the Bible, the sir. Ghost, the ghost has been mentioned as far back as in Jesus Christ before Christ was born. Ghosts are all through the Bible. If you want to talk religion, we can talk religion. Okay, let's if talk religion then, sir. 
Xenu is going to come here and he's going to take his ship that's behind Saturn and he's going to pick up all of the non thevens and we're going to go behind Saturn and live a life of happiness on another planet. Now, you want to talk about religions? Let's talk Scientology. That's not even religion, sir. That's blasphemy as far as the Bible goes. Now, what do you want to talk about? Well, I happen to agree with you. Okay. I'm not here to discuss religion or anything else. The Bible says How big is your many cock? things about the ghost. Even in the uh, the the Catholic Bible, yeah. uh, they talk about it. How? I'm not arguing ghosts or not ghosts or anything else. I'm here to prove what happens to our energy after our bodies leave us. I've been doing this for 35 years. I have never seen a ghost. All right, yeah. sir? That's why I tell you and I'll tell you to your face or any place else that I can send someone out to give you a hand if you're really serious about this. If you're here to argue with me or anything else, sir, I've got a sir, daytime job sir, that I go sir. to. This, this is what I do on the side to help people. I have, I've been doing it for 35 years. Sir, I would like mm -hmm. you to send someone out to give me a hand job, okay? Well, I think your wife might be able to do that or the black man that was there with him. They just keep the black man out of this, okay? Me and the black man well, is my problem. You like, you like men, so you said you'd like me to come out there, and I'm afraid. Uh, no, my I wife never said that. You're projecting like it too much. So why don't you call somebody else and jerk them off? Okay. Sir, you're projecting gayism on me. No, you're the one that said just now. And I, my my calls are recorded and everything else. I don't. So are mine, mine bro. People. So are mine. You, I never said nothing about being yeah, gay. I'm glad. You brought up I'm the whole gay issue. This. No, yeah. sir. I'm telling you, if you need help with uh, uh, paranormal activity of some sort, or approving or disproving it, we'll be glad to send someone out to help you. Hey, uh, man, look, I, look in your area see, you keep, and you keep going. Even after you accuse me of being a homosexual, you keep wanting to come over to my house, man. What's with that? I'm I'm in Texas, sir. You're kind of crazy. Sir, I you are a gay you. gentleman. Sir. Good night. Have a good one. Go jerk someone else off, okay? All right. Ha <laughs>